Hi, I'm Danish, uh, currently second year in forensics, and today I'm going to talk briefly about the human mind. As you all know, the human mind is connected to our five senses, which is hearing, smelling, taste, and there's other two more, which is, um, uh, yeah, see, as you can see, the fire, and the last one is feel. It's quite hot in here right now. So, yeah. So, as one of the senses I've mentioned earlier, which is sight by seeing, to see, we need light. And we all know that light comes in a lot of wavelengths, which means carries a lot of types of lights. So like from where you're seeing right now, you may see this as mostly grey and yellow, which means that the light that carries the wavelength of yellow and grey reaches you. But is it possible that among our other friends in other places, they may see this as a different wavelength of light, which means a different colour. So, so it means they can see different colours. From what I see right now, I can see purple, green, grey, orange, and yeah. That's from my perspective. Right now, I want to ask you, am I real? Think about it clearly. Am I a real person standing in front of a real person holding a real camera recording me right now? Or am I just a virtual image which appears to be a real person? So think of this as an experiment. I'm going to show you this seemingly real UKM tie and I'm going to wrap it around my neck not just once but twice and you're going to see it pass through as if it was a virtual tie. Or was it a virtual me instead? Ask yourself. As for the last thought experiment, I'm going to ask you, is everything you see is real? Because from what I know, I'm not really sure. Because this card right here, as you all know, it's a solid card. But then, sometimes I think of it as being transparent. But that's not possible, right? How can a solid card be transparent like this? I'm not sure if it's actually the patterns on the card or when it's transparent, it's the stripes on my shirt. But it's definitely something to think about.